at Women Worth and Wellness, we have an event coming up November the 7th. And if you haven't got your ticket yet, you must get it. This is a must attend event. Leading with purpose, influencing with compassion, women executives changing the game. And today I have an incredible woman who has made such a difference in our world, in our society, in her life, our lives. I have Rosemary Sadler is a social justice advocate, researcher, writer, and former president of the Ontario Black History Society. She is highly sought after speaker on black history, anti-racism, women's issues, and has written multiple books on African Canadian history, a passionate advocate for black history education. She was instrumental in establishing Black History Month and Emancipation Day in Canada and in the creation of the National Day for the Honorable Lincoln Alexander. So at Women Worth and Wellness, we're really focusing on women and their part in society and in their own personal worlds to step it up. So thank you for being involved with our purpose and our passion of helping women be their best selves and being an influence in this world. People just like you. Well, I, I want to thank Nancy Griffin for everything that she's done for her vision for this summit, uh, Women Worth and Wellness. This is an amazing way for her to get that message out to people, to encourage them. And through her creating this wonderful event to um, give other women permission to do what they can. What does this topic mean to you of this event, leading with purpose, influencing with compassion? Tell us what this means to you. Well, it, it means everything to me. Uh, clearly, as a woman of African origin living in this country, a generational woman of African origin, um, it was very painful not to see myself represented in school, in the community, and it became my work, whether I really chose it or not, to push for more representation in terms of education, materials, and media uh, that would help to reflect and support uh, African-Canadian issues, causes, and lived experience of so many people. Yeah. Including <laughs> it's absolutely so important and relevant today's to today and, and society and where we're going with. How do you see these challenging, especially for women as they're facing them today? Well, I think that, you know, this particular conference leading with purpose, uh, all women have a purpose. All people have a purpose. I think it's when you find what you are really passionate about, everything you do just flows so well. And I think that it also means that you can commit and you can do something that is meaningful to you. And when it's meaningful to you, it makes it so much easier to go in. And if you're lucky enough to get paid for doing that, so much the better. But it's also about what difference can that make for people that are working with you, people that are going to be working in the future, for your own children, for your community. Um, if there are things that you see that are problematic, it's time to step up and deal with it. 100%. So not only in the corporate world and the executive world, but in our own lives and our generations for the, our kids to come and their kids along the way. So why is it, do you think, so important, especially for women executives to be here and to change the game and step up? Um, as a woman executive, as a woman leader, uh, you are a role model. People are looking to you for uh, encouragement and inspiration about what they should do next. If they see you take action, move in a particular direction, they are going to be encouraged and empowered to do the same thing. Um, if they don't see you doing that, if they find you falling in lockstep with the usual narrative or the usual way of doing things, it will make it harder for them to challenge themselves to do something more meaningful. So I think that uh, leadership position is incredibly important, no matter what area of leadership it might be, because they are watching. And it's also important for men to see women doing things in a way that maybe they didn't expect. It's important for uh, us all, uh, as we're all moving towards that 
time and place when we can all flourish. Yes, absolutely. I believe this topic is timely, especially in this world today. And thank you. Thank you for being one of our top leaders in this world and showing us the example of what it takes to really step up and choose something different. Thank you for being with us today, Rosemary. Uh, it's been such a pleasure and honor to talk with you. Thank you and all the best for the conference.